Jones in three. What do I mean? I mean, he said you gave him one of your freaking business cards. He said what? Don't fucking lie to me, Otis. I told you when you're working for me, you don't hand out your fucking business cards to my clients, you thieving cocksucker, you piece of shit. Yo, man, you're not being reasonable. He also told me you dropped one of his boxes. There were freaking Skull Island roaches crawling out of it. And on top of that, I get a call today from yesterday's client that you tore the finish off a dresser. What? The tape was too goddamn sticky. Yeah, I can't take this anymore. Every job I send you, I gotta get phone calls. It's not working out, bud. Sorry. What the hell are you talking about, Cracker? You send me to a job with Volkswagen-sized rats. I mean, I was stepping through cat shit to get to the boxes. Oh, boo-hoo. Boo-hoo. Who else you got that would take these crappy-ass ghetto jobs? I should sue you for discrimination. Oh, here we go, you people. You people? Yeah, here we go. You got nobody that will do these kinds of jobs that you send me on. So get off your fucking high horse, Big Daddy, because I'm not your house Negro. All right, all right. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to go to that Phil who is trying to Jew me out of my money and work out something about the finish. Then I'm going to show you how to properly wrap shit, and you're going to stop handing out your personal cards. Okay, okay, fine. But don't send me on any more of these fucking hazmat jobs. Okay, look it. You're right. From now on, I'm going to give you a $50 bump if there are any biohazards. Well, why don't you start right now? Don't push your luck.